Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Tap the three dots in the upper right corner, then choose People and Options. Tap on Block less than number greater than. A pop-up window will ask you to confirm you want to block the number, noting that you will no longer receive calls or texts from this person. Tap Block to confirm. Take our lead. Simply put, after you block a number, that caller can no longer reach you. Phone calls do not ring through to your phone, and text messages are not received or stored. All new calls and texts, however, will now arrive on your phone normally. Make your mark, take our lead. You can block unwanted text messages on an Android phone by blocking the number with just a few taps. To block a message, select it and choose Details from the menu, then choose Block and Report Spam. Visit Business Insider's Tech Reference Library for more stories. Make your mark, take our lead. Fortunately, you don't need a special message blocker to do so. You can block texts on iPhone and Android using settings built into those devices. When you block a number to stop getting texts from it, you're also preventing phone calls. Take our lead. Generally speaking, Android phone users can recover the blocked messages if they did not delete them from the block list. Here are the steps. Tap the call and text blocking. Click on History. Choose Text Blocked History. Select the blocked message that you want to restore. Tap the Restore to Inbox. Let's help you make your mark. Block messages or spam from the home screen. Tap the messages icon. Tap menu settings, block numbers and messages, block numbers. Manually enter number and tap the plus, plus sign, or choose from inbox or contacts. When finished, tap the back arrow. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.